Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you guys just a quick update on what's been going on for my clay. So, I have these two Mario and Luigi hats. They're in like a little keychain charm thingy. I don't know what they're called. And so I did wear one to school and then the Luigi fell off and I lost him. So, I forgot to make it. Now I have Luigi with no Mario because I'm going to add it to it. So yeah, these are like Mario Luigi keychains. I think they're really cute and they don't fall off. Yeah. So I, I'm just going to show you guys like a quick, quick update of what's been going on. So I finally got the um the silicone for deco den from home depot Let's see if I can from gap brand you can get it from home depot and just so you can like find the area where is it it's for um for doors, trim, and windows, so you can find like what section it's in. So it comes in this little tubey thingy, and you need to cut off the edges because it's like sealed. And it's really hard to cut it off because it's like really extremely thick. So yeah, and it dries like squishy, I guess. Not completely positive because mine is drying right now. I just made a brand new Dicoden. I think it's really cute, personally, but you guys don't have to like it. I mean, I'm not forcing you to like it, but I like it. And it's just like this little box. I'm going to keep my canes in it. Like, I only have a few canes, and it's not even dry yet. It's really heavy now because it's just plastic, and now it's just really heavy. So, um, I was trying to do it sort of chocolate themed, as you can tell, I, th I think it's really cute. And I think this stuff dries squishy, I'm not positive. But I was practicing on a cardboard box, on just like designs, to see if they're squishy. And then, so, I got these little temporary tattoos on my hand. I thought it was really cute, like the design that I did. Oopsies. Oops, oops. So, I did it like crooked right here. So I thought it was really cute. And I did it like on the side of my eye. So yeah, that's what's been going on. And I thought it would be really cute to decorate my TLS with a little whipped cream topping with a cherry. So yeah. Um, I can show you guys all my deco den right now. Because I have it all right here. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just gonna just fill it. Whatever. So this is all my deco den. They're not all from the silicone, they're from the deco den that I made at first. So this one that I already showed you guys. And this one, that is a mirror. Yeah. 
And this one, it's like a cap for something, but here's a cap. It's really a little vitamins jar. Because I use like old containers for my clay. So, there's that. It's like fruit themed. Um, this one with just a whipped cream topping. This was my first deco den ever. This was my first deco den ever. This was my first deco den with silicone. Because this one is um, the just deco den sauce. Oh, sauce. Deco den liquid that I made. Check out Dinosaur Gabby. She has a really good one. And it works really good. And it's items that you could actually have around your house. So, yeah, that. It. And um, that is what Gabby's, what she used, um, it's, it like inflates, like, it's all puffy. It's all puffy right here. And then you can like hear it inflating too. So it inflates. It's not, it's not like good, but it's still cute and everything. So yeah, all four of these I used with the Tico Den sauce. This one. quick update and I did make some tutorials on most of these but I'm gonna make a tutorial soon on this love bracelet I think I I think it's really cute and when it bakes it's squishy because it's so thin but it's it like doesn't break and it's really cute I've worn it I wear it every day and it's never broken And it's my size. It's easy to put on because it's like bendy. So that's it. And I made a whole bunch of tutorials on most of this stuff. And I will be making more tutorials today because I usually have like a day where I make a few tutorials. And I did say that I was going to make tutorials on things when it was on my clay update. Well, it doesn't say clay update, but it says all my polymer clay. Um, I'm going to do one for this because I think it's extremely cute. A little 24 pack of crayons. It's not really 24. It's really 5. But it's extremely cute. And it doesn't even use any of your like favorite colors. It doesn't use well you can personalize what colors you want. You can actually make it twenty-four. I made this other one. I like this one better than the other one that I made. Let me show you the other one. Okay, here it is. I made this ten pack of crayons. Really three. I put it like double the amount. I, I don't know. I don't even. I don't even like add it or anything. So let me show you what my next tutorials are going to be on. It's going to be on. Um, these. I'm oh, sorry. Can you guys see that? It's going to be on a little swirly button. Which is really cute. It looks really good too. Because like. You want to eat it. Because it's like dripping off. And everything. And this one is just really cute. Especially if you draw a face on it. What? Yeah. I don't, I don't really like drawing faces very much. I pick certain things to draw faces on. So. That. Oh and I'm going to make a tutorial on a little owl. Um, I don't have it with me right now, but I'm going to make a tutorial on it. A little gray owl. So, 
Yeah, thanks for watching my clay update. I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.